Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I have some new products to share with you from Country Craft Creations. While I was there, I was able to snag these from Tamara's house. She just had them delivered um, and they just came available online. And I want to say she has hmm, two or three of the other new ones that came in, which one was Paris... And then there's like a back to school one. Oh, does she have a third one? I think maybe she only has two. Um, but I wanted to walk you guys so you could see what these three look like here. Um, let's go ahead and get started. This one is family so obviously it is great for ancestry for just family hello <laughs> it does have some beautiful colors in it so let's just go ahead and get into it so these are brand new from echo park in cartabella and if you did not know that is the same company echo park is the smooth lighter weight paper it's not lightweight but it's lighter weight than cartabella cartabella is that thicker paper textured um just one of my faves now this is pretty the floral here that is the b side then you have the cut aparts um so yep all family oriented we, would, we do not remember days, we remember moments. So here's like a family tree, a story to be told. That's cool. Um, a time to be remembered. So it has like memories. So yeah, this is great for all the family things. That is the back side. Then you have this one, which again, if you make little Barbie houses or anything, you can cut these as little pictures, artwork. <laughs> I had mentioned this the other day. Um, I do, I'm gonna have to tear down my nieces, but for my daughter and my niece, I build like Barbie worlds out of um, like the plastic storage units. And I just, I use my craft supplies. Now this, okay, right now I'm loving these bees right here. That's pretty. That's pretty. The butterflies are pretty. Why do I not remember this being as pretty when I looked at it? <laughs> I don't know something's weird because I'm loving this just as like this is a beautiful fall collection right here I love this just for fall forget the family part of it like these colors are so pretty and then you have these um, different cut aparts so you can use these for tags and everything which I think I think he just started doing like these different sizes they're not true, like three by fours. You get some sentiments in here, family history, memories together. That's cool. We we are family. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but Tiffany's got a breakout in the song and she can't sing. There you go. Look, like, look, that's, that's just pretty. I'm loving these florals. <laughs> okay, I see. Yep, love these colors. I loved this one. I don't know why, but I loved this one. That's the B side. Now, I don't like it with that. So I'm going to flip back over. <laughs> I got my little florals going here. And then we have the four. This is probably called six by four. Yeah, six by four journaling cards. Um, what does that say? The most treasured heirlooms are the sweet memories of our family that we pass down to our children. Oh, off starts and ends with family. Okay, I mean, these are pretty cool sentiments and sayings. These would also make great cards to send, you know, to a loved one. There's another beautiful color. Loving this. Another floral, and that is the B side. Okay, seriously, you guys. You could just use this for a beautiful, stunning fall collection. And this is the 4 by 6 cut-aparts. And then you have this one here. And, oh, that's just so pretty. I love this color. So pretty. Then there is the sticker sheet. So you get all these elements. What does that say? 
Oh, it's a little candle. How cute. All these little, I'm looking at everything if you guys are wondering why I'm moving so slow because I'm forgetting one that I'm filming and supposed to show you and I'm looking at it because I haven't actually seen it in full. So cute. We had um, the Country Craft Creations retreat last week in Madison and his wife, um, Keisha, came. Madison is obviously Echo Park Cartabella, and Keisha is Caterpillar. Um, they came, and it was just a blast. So you never know what you're going to get at Country Craft Creations. That's why I say in-person is always the best route, because there are sometimes some surprises that happen. And I get, you know, some of us, we just can't do the virtual. I totally get it. Or we can't do the in-person because of whatever. So there's the virtual option, but in-person is just way more fun. Way more fun. And he gave away so many prizes. It was crazy. Um, okay, then this one. I saw this a little bit ago online, and I just absolutely love this one. I don't know why. It's not like I've been to London. My whole family went when I was, I think I was in like 8th or ninth grade. But I was too scared. I did not want to fly overseas, so I asked not to go. Yeah, I'm that I'm that kid who said I don't want to go to um, overseas. Basically, whatever. I don't even know. London, Paris, somewhere over there they went. <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> I just think this is so cool. I love this collection. Okay, we're gonna go through it right now, and I love that. Okay, and this is Cartabella. So I love that he is switching it up. They're doing some different cut apart sizes. So cute. Love the stripe. And again, Cartabella is that textured cardstock. It just feels so good to play with. And then, okay. We have we have two of each in the in the kit, and like I said, this is live right now on Country Craft Creations. And you have the three by four cut aparts. And I'm reading the little sayings to myself. <laughs> oh yeah, I was gonna. I'm doing it in my head with my little British accent, and it's not coming out very well. <laughs> I just need a spot of tea. <laughs> yeah, they're like, girl, stop it. Don't even try. Okay, I, I'm flipping the wrong ones over, but this one has the cute little taxis. Do they call it a taxi? Let me get a little closer and see. Yep, taxi. And I really enjoy saying bollocks. It cracks me up. Very cute. I love that blue. That was Tiff's accent. <laughs> you have that cute postcard there's no place like London this is the B side with the red telephone booths just a fun collection now obviously there's some really big prints if you're getting the actual 12 by 12 kit um, and just remember don't be scared of the big prints because you can create you know your mini album and just cut this in half and have it on one side and then the other half on the other side and you still see your 12 by 12 and this is the B side to that that's cool and then I think I just really love like the pop of black with the you know primaries basically I just I love this collection and it's so cool. And the Paris is pretty too. And I'm going to need that because someone's always asking me to create a Paris, <clears throat> excuse me, themed album. So I do, and I do have some stuff in my stash, of course, but I like to have options. I just think this is fun, especially if you, you know, did a trip to London. This is a must have for you to, um, you know, create a mini album with. Or a few if you went with some friends and you want to gift them a gift. Now, I think it's more fun if you're going with friends somewhere to make the gift ahead of time. And then while you guys are there, you know, you have your little Insta camera 
or your little printer and then you could print off photos while you guys are there each day and put them in your little books okay i can't like so cute best in show stephen duncan of course again this is a cartabella i just here we go i i just think it's so cute but you guys know i love the critters and I don't know if there's two. Let me just see real quick. I don't think there's two of everything in here. No. Let me hold hold on. Let's see what we get. Um, we get 12 double sided. Yeah, so I I think they're I think wow, are they all individual? Well, we're gonna find out. Let's just go. So you have this one with the doggies. And I'm just a looking. See what's up with this doggy? Oh, <laughs> okay. I gotta pull this closer because <laughs> I couldn't focus. Because I was like, why is this spaniel like? You know the you can't see it. <laughs> no, it's not a spaniel. It's a dog carrying a shoe. <laughs> I really thought that was like a floppy ear. You know, that was another ear, but its face was gone. <laughs> you know, who who's ready to laugh? That's what this channel is all about. Just gonna say, okay, Tiffany has issues. Look at all the babies. And then you have a beautiful uh, navy on the back. Look at these cute little cut aparts. How cute is that? And I love just having a good mix of dogs. And these are all dogs that have won. I love watching this every year. So cute. Have the red on the back. But this red has, it looks even more textured. Because it is, there's like a really, can you guys see that? Yes. There's like a faint, it looks like that is the texture. But it's like, you know, a, a red on red, like lines. A pattern. It's really cool. Very interesting. And then you have, of course, the wall of frames with all the babies. Look how cute they all are. So cute. And then that is the back side. That is gorgeous. Has the little silhouette of the dog. Love this plaid. Love, love, love. The back is the bones. So, you know, you could just pull out, you know, if you wanted to do like a basic, let me just see here. You could pull out all the colors or it could just be like a cream and black with a pop of green. So you could have a lot of fun with this. I'm looking at like some of the cut aparts right here. So you could create a cute little um, card folio and just keep it in just the neutrals with a pop of the green would be pretty. Or again, you could showcase all the colors. So just some different options for you. Just loving this. And then you have these over here. Oh my gosh, look at the little certificate. Can you guys see them? Not really in frame. That is cute. Cute, cute, cute. And then a nice stripe on the back. Again, another sheet with different dogs. And this one, let's see how this compares to the other one. I feel like there's more color in this one. Oh, maybe not. So, let's see. Is there any repeats? This, mm, no, no repeats. I feel like this this one is, but going, yeah, a different way, and this one has a collar. I'm really good at that, you know, point out the 10 different things. <laughs> That's me. I love playing those games, but I love that you have two different pages with different dogs, um, dog breeds on it. That's cool. Very cute. You got a husky in there. You know, this this little one might be a pit bull. A little on the thinner side, but that looks pit bullish. Got the rots in here. Where it was in there. <laughs> no, Rottweilers on something else. I know I saw a Rottweiler. 
I, I just, I love doggies. I love all animals. If you guys, oh my gosh. Look at that. A paw print. So it's like a dark navy on a navy. I love this like navy color. This is so pretty. But, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, this is a pretty, you guys know, I'm, a, I'm a, I geek out on paper. So just deal with it. I get all excited, but that is stinking cute. These are great for Father's Day. Just great, even at Christmas, great gift to make for Christmas. An album, especially like if someone lost their pet this year and you wanna gift them a one of a kind um, Christmas project. Oh, so fun. Love this like tonal, um, tone on tone that they're doing. Really cool. And then you have the four by fours. So yeah, this is one sheet of each. So you are gonna need two packs because you know, we don't do one sheet of each. We all need two of each. Just saying, these are cute. Oh, it gives the breeds. Okay, here we go. We got the Beagle, German Shepherd, the Bichon Fries, Bichon Fries, Fries, I don't know. Basset Hound, Irish Setter. I'm not reading all of them, but <laughs> Pug. All the babies. Oh, so cute. I'm trying to see the only one. Like, I, I will still love them because they're a pet, but Greyhounds, I'm sorry. You're not cute. You're really skinny. You need some meat on your bones. <laughs> but I still love them. Oh, my gosh. So adorable. Yep, there's the pity. Oh my goodness, Springer Spaniel. Oh, I've had so many animals. Luckily, my my mom liked animals too because we had, I'm trying to think, three different dogs. I don't even know how many cats. Goldfish, birds, snake when she didn't know it frogs and tadpoles when she didn't like it <laughs> when we first moved um I was what I was 10 years old and we moved to a different city I'm just loving this these um like tone on tones this one now is a black on the red but it's very faint um moved here our house there was only like two houses on the block and so there was construction all around us and there was ponds, so my sister and I, we would go get tadpoles out of the ponds. We would build forts. Yep, all those things. All those things. We had never seen that where we lived before because it was like a, you know, it wasn't a new development. So we had fun. And I just, I just love animals. They're just so sweet. So cute. Oh, just loving it, loving it, all of it. And then you have the beautiful sticker sheet. So all I got was the collection kit. I'm sure there's probably more things going along with the collection little corgis. Oh, I might have to make something for my friend who just got two new corgis. Ugh, can you stand it? Can you stand it? Oh my goodness, bow wow. That's so cute. Yes, must have. Okay, you guys got to let me know out of these three, which one is your favorite? I'm definitely going with this one just because I love my babies. And then, I don't know, like I said, at first I wasn't loving, I mean, it was okay, but I wasn't loving the family. But when I got into it and saw the colors, oh my gosh. So Tammy has the other ones and she is going to do, I think, a live walkthrough at some point. So again, if you are not already on um, Scrapbookers of Country Craft Creations on Facebook, you're missing out because I'm just going to tell you, she just yesterday posted, um, what was it? Oh, la, 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 la. Not yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. Well, anyway, this week she posted that she was going to put some mini boxes, mini mystery boxes together. And they weren't many. They were still big, giant mystery boxes um, with past kits that were left over from retreats, etc. 
and I saw the kits. They were amazing. And the boxes were for $75. It was like over $200 worth of stuff. And they sold out in less than 30 minutes. And she does that to the member, gives the option to the members first and scrapbookers or bookers of country craft creation. So you have to join. And sometimes she'll just randomly do, hey, here's a contest today. Answer this question and there'll be a random winner. So, you know, don't, don't miss out on the goodies. But she'll do a live. One, follow her on YouTube, Country Craft Creations, and it'll pop up. But also in Scrapbookers, Booker, she usually gives a notification when she's about to go live. Um, but yeah, I will link the other three. I think it's three that she has. It's for sure two. Like I said, I remember the back to school one. That was a beautiful collection as well. Um, and I think that was by Stephen Duncan too. Don't quote me on that. And then there was a Paris one, adorable, um, but just brand new collections. Like I said, oh, and, 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 okay. Do I even have those on it? Ooh, this room's messy. Ooh, okay. Hold on. I don't know if I can get to it. Hold please. I don't want to knock this over. I'm trying to see. Okay, just wait, just wait, just wait. Hold on. I know I have it somewhere. And it's going to be right in front of my face. Where would I have put it? Oh. I wanted to show you guys the Wizard of Oz. I showed you the collection that I got. The other day, man, I thought it was more organized than this. <laughs> I know it's like right here. And when I say right here, I have 10 right here's. I'm on the ground. If you're wondering where the heck I just went. Oh, I can't find it. I'm going to have to. I was going to show you the Echo Park Wizard of Oz. Hmm. I don't like it. I don't like it. That how it matches with the Country Craft Creations Wizard of Oz. But I have too many piles right here. Is it this one? Nope. 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 Not that one either. Okay. Darn it. I wasn't prepared. I really wanted to show you guys how they match up. But you'll eventually see. Okay. So there you guys go. Hop on over to countrycraftcreations.com and um, make sure you sign up on Facebook, Scrapbookers or Country Craft Creations, if you want to see all the fun excitement that happens there. And don't forget, if you are new to Country Craft Creations and you make a purchase, sign up for the rewards because you get money back towards future purchases. So you don't want to, don't be giving up their free money. Don't be giving up that free money. Make sure you sign up using the rewards. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure, let me know which one was your favorite. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.